Here's a question that I get asked quite a lot by a select few. What is dyspraxia? Yes, what is dyspraxia? It is defined by the National Health Service as a condition affecting physical coordination. It's often referred to with regard to children as developmental coordination disorder. It also used to be known as clumsy child syndrome because it can affect the fine and or gross motor coordination. And it may also affect speech. Like all the other conditions of neurodiversity, dyslexia, ADHD, etc., there is a lot of variation of severity within the condition. What people tell me, those who have a diagnosis of dyspraxia, is that they often bump into furniture. They're forever bumping their hips on office desks, for example, or they have difficulty with fiddly stuff. Sometimes too, they can have poor muscle tone. Sometimes they struggle to say words or to find the words that they want to say. As you can imagine, this is hugely frustrating. And I meet people with dyspraxia quite a lot. Some of them are very keen sports people or active outdoors. So there's a lot of variety in how this condition of dyspraxia can affect you. All the people with dyspraxia that I have met have learned to drive. There are also the associated difficulties of memory, concentration, distraction, information processing, planning, organization, and time management, all to a greater or lesser extent, the feature with all these neurodiverse conditions. So, for example, if you have a diagnosis of dyspraxia, dyslexia, and ADHD, as people sometimes do, it can be really difficult to work out which traits belong to what. Everyone is different, remember. So if you want to find out more about dealing with the challenges associated with these neurodiverse conditions, take a look at my online video course about understanding and managing dyslexia. I talk about how to deal with these kinds of challenges there. Thank you for taking the time to watch today's video. If you found this video useful, then why not take a look at this one? I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.